what we do here is go back, 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 back. my beautiful ninjas welcome back to another video I hope you guys are all having an awesome awesome day so as you guys can tell by the title this video is going to be my Valentine's Day gift guide for her so whether you are purchasing a gift for your girlfriend your wife whether you are purchasing a gift for your friend whatever the case may be I just want to go ahead and just give you guys a couple of ideas of things that you can purchase for Valentine's Day for your special someone. So, of course, I am going to be doing a Valentine's Day gift guide for him. That video that video will go up on Friday. So, I'm going to record the one for him basically after I record this one. So, I do have some notes written down on my phone, so I'm just going to go ahead and pull that up really quick and then we'll go ahead and just jump into the gift guide. Obviously, I don't think that <laughs> I don't think that you necessarily have to do this whole like just on Valentine's Day you purchase something for your special someone just to show them that you care and that you love them. I think that this is something that should happen all the time. And honestly, I feel like we've gotten to such a place of expectancy. We expect to see our loved ones, you know, the next day. We expect to wake up the next day. So I feel like we take a lot of people and ourselves and our lives for granted. So definitely don't just do this just because it's Valentine's Day. Make sure that you continue to show the people that you love, that are in your life, that you actually love them. It doesn't necessarily have to be by buying gifts, honestly, um, but just making sure that you just make the effort every single day, every breath that you're able to actually take. It's important that you take the effort um, to show them and to share with them the way that you care about them. So. I am going to just share with you guys, if you are interested in possibly just purchasing some something for your special someone and you're looking for like ideas of what to get, obviously you're going to know better than I do because you know that person, so you know what their interests um, and desires and wants and things like that are. But these are just kind of like things that I feel like most women will enjoy. So. Um, I'm going to go ahead and, of course, leave everything down below as well as far as the ideas that I'm mentioning to you guys. And I will also link specific, you know, items as well in case you just need to make your life a lot easier, pretty much. So jumping into it, when it comes to the gifts that I think would really work for a woman in general, I'm just going to start off with a basic gift, and that is gift cards. You guys, gift cards save lives, okay? <laughs> okay, I'm just kidding. But... I think that gift cards are really just a really great um, gift idea to give to your special someone or your friend or whatever the case may be. But I think that for women, I was going to say that we're complicated, but we're really not. But I feel like sometimes our desires, our wants and things like that change a lot. So I feel like if, especially if you're trying to get this for your spouse, you know, look at, pay attention to the websites that she goes on and she stocks all the time. Pay attention to the things, the websites where she goes and she puts things in her carts and then she just X's out of it. Maybe purchase a gift card for one of those specific stores. Because a lot of times women, we have such a hard time treating ourselves. I think that we're taught to be nurturing and we're taught to do so many things for other people and we're great at it. But I think a lot of times it is difficult for us to just spend the money on ourselves and just do it pretty much so i think if you pay attention to your special someone or your friend whoever you're looking to purchase this gift for if you pay attention to kind of like their patterns what websites they typically surf you know what stores they typically put things in their cart and just x out of it and never purchase it what do they say that they are currently you know thinking of buying or whatever the case may be when you pay attention to those little things buying a gift card is just a really great gift idea because it shows that you're thinking of them and that also it just gives them the freedom to purchase anything that they actually want without feeling guilty pretty much so gift cards are going to be pretty much my best um, gift idea to be honest with you because any and everyone can use a gift card somewhere so of course you can get specific store gift cards or you can get like just a regular Visa or a MasterCard gift card so that they can pretty much use it for whatever, whether they want to buy groceries or they want to buy pet food or they want to actually treat themselves. Just the gift card will definitely be beneficial for them. So hopefully that makes sense. But that's definitely the first um, gift idea that I can give you guys for sure. So. The second thing that I want to mention to you guys when it comes to just a gift will be a book. Um, of course, for women, the reason that I say books is because I feel like women, again, we're taught to be so many things to so many other people. And although we are great at it, I think self-care is extremely important. So just getting them books that 
whether it's based on an interest that they have, whether if they like to knit, if you want to get them a knitting book or a cooking book or whatever the case may be, it just basically shows that you've been thinking about them. And I think getting them a book that will help to um, help them to pour into themselves is extremely important. Self-care is not talk taught enough and it's not talked about enough. And I think women, we have a harder time really taking care of ourselves and, and even thinking about ourselves. So a book will definitely be another really great um, gift idea as well. So just getting them books that are based around their interests, based around something that they've been thinking of doing, um, or just like a self-help, self-care, self-love type of book, I think is extremely um, a good idea to do and just an extremely really great and generous gift as well. So that's gonna be the second idea. The third thing that I want to mention to you guys is going to be a massage. Again, women, we are so nurturing. We do so many things for different people. And when I'm saying this, I'm not dogging the men at all. So men, you have your own separate video. Relax yourself, okay? <laughs> but women, we are so nurturing and we do so many things for so many different people. And a lot of times it is difficult for us to treat ourselves without feeling guilty about it, whether it is... Am I spending this money wisely? Or especially if you're a, a parent, everything becomes about that child. Or if you're married, everything becomes about this relationship that you're trying to nurture and to build on. And there's nothing wrong with that, but I feel like we should also be taught the flip side of it. Just learning that self-care is extremely important and that treating yourself is necessary. It doesn't necessarily have to be about spending a whole bunch of money, but something like a massage, whether you decide to give her a massage or just purchase like some type of spa thing for her, she will definitely appreciate it. I remember a couple of years ago, it was my birthday and Tony got me like a spa, like a spa day and they gave me a facial, a massage, um, and man manicure, pedicure, eyebrows, you know, all of that. When I tell you guys, when it got time for me to do my manicure, pedicure, I was so relaxed that I was literally sleeping. And the lady just kept waking me up like, turn your hand, turn your hand. So I'm telling you, she may not necessarily do it for herself, but she will definitely appreciate it. And she will show her appreciation for just you thinking of her and just wanting her to be kind of like in a relaxed state, which basically helps to bring out her best sense of self. So a massage is definitely a really great, great gift idea. Um, the next idea, that was number three. Okay, so the fourth gift idea is kind of like specific to your woman, okay? So the fourth gift idea is going to be perfume, of course. We all like to smell good, okay? And I feel like for women, Perfume is just kind of like the finishing touch to the way that we feel um, along with obviously our hair, what we have on, our nails, things like that. But I think that perfume, especially when you're going out, whatever the case may be, it just kind of like finishes off the way that we feel, whether it's sexy or um, flirty or a little bit like mysterious or dangerous, like it definitely just kind of like enhances the way that we feel in our femininity so perfume is definitely a really great gift idea obviously you would have to know your woman to know kind of like what type of scents that she likes if she likes something that's fresh or sweet or fruity or floral i would say definitely pay attention to her and maybe like smell some of the perfumes that she has you may not be able to identify the notes itself but if you want to take one of her perfumes go to the store with it and just be like look this is the one that she wears all the time i need something that smells very similar to this of course, there's ways of getting around it and making sure that it's a really great gift idea for her as well. So perfume is definitely going to be another good one. And then the last gift idea that I want to mention to you guys is, of course, jewelry. Um, of course, I want to say don't wait just a Valentine's Day to do this, but I think that it's sweet. I think regardless, you know, if you're being genu uh, generous and you're being genuine about your gift I think it's just I think it's a, a, an amazing thing honestly I don't think you should wait till Valentine's Day but hey it is what it is if this is what reminds you that you have an amazing woman by your side or you have an amazing friend or you have an amazing sister whatever it is to show that you actually care about this person I think that I'm not gonna knock Valentine's Day honestly so jewelry is definitely gonna be another way to go of course you have to kind of get her sense of style whether it is that you're looking to propose yes um, or if you are just looking to just add to her makeup collection whether it's a nice watch whether it's um, a ring whether it is a necklace I think earrings are a really 
nice gift to give a woman obviously if she's someone that wears a lot of accessories and things like that you will know specific to her what type of jewelry piece that she would enjoy the most but I think earrings are a beautiful gift idea they're just I don't know I just feel like it frames the face and yeah so I would definitely recommend earrings if you're not if this is not obviously your significant other if you're not ready for all that I would say definitely do earrings um, and then of course a necklace is really nice as well but of course it just depends on your woman specifically so that's gonna be pretty much the last gift idea that I have for her for this Valentine's Day so make sure that you guys check the description box down below I will make sure to leave some options for you down below just to simplify your life a little bit okay so of course this is the end of another video so we are going to be sharing what we are currently grateful for in this moment and of course I definitely want to say that I am grateful for you guys um, I think more recently I've just been again like I mentioned to you guys this year for me is more about purpose and um, just staying in alignment with that and I think that I've been looking at old videos and things like that when I first started and just recognizing that what I really wanted to do is not only just find something that's an outlet for me but also just do something that helps to entertain you guys help you guys a little bit guide you guys a little bit and of course motivate and uplift your spirits as well so I'm hoping that I am that's the way that you guys are receiving my energy because that's the intention behind everything and every video that I put up as well. I definitely am grateful for each and every one of you who have hit the subscribe button, whether you guys actually watch every time I upload a video or not. I'm just really grateful for each and every one of you because I feel like nothing happens by chance nothing I don't believe in coincidence so I feel like we are connected for a reason so whether I am inspiring you now or I'm gonna inspire you five years from now or six months from now whatever the case may be I'm just really grateful for each and every one of you that have taken the time to click that subscribe button you know of course click the notification gang give my videos a thumbs up comment down below I'm just really grateful for each and every one of you guys honestly so thank you so much again for tuning in to another video let me know down below out of the ideas that I've given you what you're actually thinking of possibly purchasing for her whoever her is um, let me know what you guys are thinking of possibly purchasing for her or if you have something else that I did not mention let me know exactly what your thoughts and ideas and things like that would be as well so thank you again be safe stay blessed and remember to always always treat yourself peace out